Hello everyone, this video explains the properties and styling of the button widget. So let's start with dropping our button from the widget's inventory. You can expand it in any direction, and it will automatically resize the padding. Now let's dive into its properties. Button text. We can rename this button component with whatever action it performs. Let us say, save underscore changes. Loading state. We can also set the loading state of the button programmatically when it performs the action. Now let us look into events associated with the button. We can add an event handler. Once done, we can explore different actions in the button. You can edit the alert message, for example. Saved. You can also set the alert type as success. Now clicking the button shows an alert message. We can edit the layout for different screens. Toggle on or off to control the widget's visibility on desktop and mobile. You can also programmatically change its value by clicking on the FX button next to it. Now let us see how we style our button widget. Click on the Styles tab. These are the following styles associated with the button widget. Background color. Change the background color of the button by entering the hex color. Text color. We can also change the color of the button text. We will keep it as default. Visibility. Toggle on or off to control the visibility of the widget. We can programmatically change its value by clicking on the FX button next to it. Disable. We can toggle to disable the button or programmatically change its value by clicking on the FX button. Border Radius Modify the border radius of the button to make it look pretty, I am using 16. This is what our final button looks like. I hope this video was informative. Thank you for watching.